the edge shed and we're back in the shed and we're on the soapbox now interestingly enough the idea is coming on pretty good uh, as you can see here there's my uh, my rear discs they're actually bicycle ones and I've found some calipers bit of an issue with the calipers but I'm, I don't know quite which one's going to go what where but uh, can't think, was it that one? That was, that was, I don't know uh, I'm sure which is which to be uh, basically this this is the wrong side but basically look that is obviously the wrong side but that is what they're going to go like but on the other side obviously so in other words it'll be bolting down somewhere on there but I've got odd calipers just, just for good measure they look like they're all the same but they're not they're all different so I'm going to go with the two that are going to be the easiest to mount which is that one on that side and this one almost goes flush onto here but I've had a bit of problem with here because this was found on the disc so I've had to cut it off and re-weld it back on which is what I'm in the process of doing but the, the welder has just decided to the nozzle's welded itself to the welder because I've got to run off this essentially and it does like the power drain so the idea is this that obviously goes on there uh, that spins pretty freely from what I can see so if I just give you a quick idea this is the caliper Take this one. Take this side. This side. Yeah, there you go. So there's the cover for that side. Uh, sits there like that. I'm going to put a T piece on here with using one of the other pipes, and that will come around to there. And that should be quite a simple matter of just getting some bolts on there and getting it to be literally be sort of free to it be to float about openly or be straight, so it doesn't bind basically. But anyway, we'll soon we'll soon know. To be continued. If not, we've got the old faithful handbrake. So, I've got to build some on the back here, and I've got to build some on the front, but I've got to try and stand to the weight, so I'm actually sort of thinking along the idea of, I don't know, whatever key I can save, so maybe I could drill some holes in some of the tubes, uh, drill some holes in maybe the front axle, I don't know, maybe, no, probably not, probably drill some holes in the, in the maybe change the, maybe, I don't know, we'll see. Maybe the pedal box will go. But yeah, so obviously I've got to weld all that up. I've got to make some sort of framework to come back here so that I can do this roll cage. And I've got to do it like a, a bar on the front with a toe and eye and a toe and eye on the back. And I've got to re do all, weld all this up because I missed all this. So that's why I'm doing it now. But I'm just having a bit of a. Oh, I should have it round way round. I should, I should clear all this. All this should be cleared. And I should turn it round. And then I could kick it up and I could weld it properly. Will I? Probably not. But will I want to? Yes, I will. I'd love to. So for the minute, I'm going to say, that's coming on. I've got a lock tile that. I've got it binding a little bit here. See, it's binding, so we will peel that. It's possibly that rubber seal, to be honest. The of the, it's probably the um, seal, but it's only got rubber down here once or three times. So it really matter. I need to weld this. I need to get in behind there and weld that. I need to get behind here, behind here on that side. So I'll do a bit more of that. And then, as I said, we'll just maybe go with some weight shavings. We'll sort of maybe plane this off because we don't need that really. Um, unless we need the, something else. It's got to get the seat, which is over there. So I'll get the seat base decided how that's going to go. Obviously, once I get this, I'll do what I'm going to do here. And how we can do the brakes. Seriously tempted to put them on here. Like so I could have got them on there. So because I've only got that much movement in the steering. That ain't that much compared to a bicycle. So getting a bit of a you see there look I'm getting a bit of a Proshenko to be honest. I think something's happening there. I don't know what but we'll see now. have to put some on here on the stock because I think we're gonna we're gonna get a little overkill there that we're putting a lot of strain on that boot on that that joint is the one that's the worst joint of the lot that one is he's the one that's got a lot of play in him. Might better get one. We'll go down and go try and say check out disability people. See if they got one. Uh gotta sort out the tires. 
I'm going to take these front wheels off, machine some, grind some of that hubs away, line out there. I don't know. I've got to get, I just jump to, I need to get it how it is and then get it away and see what way it. And if it's underweight or overweight, whatever, I'm going to start trimming it down. I don't know any other way of doing it. There's just no other way. I just don't know what I'm going to do. So, anyway, we'll see. Let's get it built first and then we'll worry about it. So, if you enjoyed watching this video, like, subscribe. If you don't, don't look, because it can only get worse, which it probably will. Talk to you soon. Bye.